When it comes to supplements with cancer, we, we believe that if we understand the cancer cell itself and we understand how that cancer cell responds to supplements, then we can safely do that. And we use a lab in Greece, RGCC, which allows us not only- In Greece? Yeah, mm-hmm. so we send it. So it's, and, and initially I, I worked with them for support of oligonucleotide therapy for tick-borne illnesses and chronic viral infections. This but is they really have been, heavy stuff, But folks. they have been around for 20, over 20 years. <laughs> and what they do is they identify a patient's cancer cells. Yeah. And then they look at which- not only chemotherapeutic agents best work with that cancer cell, Mm -hmm. but also which nutraceuticals are safe. So there are some patients whose cancer cells upregulate the GST pathway, which is where you make glutathione, one of your number one antioxidants in your body that we want Mm -hmm. to defend ourselves from toxins and other things. But, But in some people, their cancer uses that, is is turning that on Mm -hmm. to make more glutathione to protect itself, the cancer cell, against the chemo agents. So we would never want to give a patient glutathione as a supplement, knowing that that might make their cancer worse. 